We're gonna steam some pap cho, uh, some pap chai together, guys. Come along. Hi guys, welcome to Selvan Kitchen today, guys. In Selvan Kitchen, we have an easy, awesome, delicious recipe for you guys today. Nothing hard, nothing too difficult. Very easy, delicious recipe, guys. So stay tuned for it. So in Selvan Kitchen, guys, we're gonna steam some nice pap chai. In Jamaica, we call it pap chow. So this pap chow already clean already. Already cut them up. Already freeze them in the freezer. So we're gonna take them out and do a little easy recipe for you guys. So I have a tablespoon of half of olive oil, I have a pinch of onion powder, I have a pinch of garlic powder, I have a pinch of salt, I have a piece of white onion, I have a piece of red bell pepper, I have a two cloves of garlic, I have a piece of orange bell pepper, and I have a pinch of a peach piece of spring onion. My apology guys. So in Selvan Kitchen guys, we're gonna look up an easy steam pap chow, pap chow or pap chai. So what we're doing now guys, we're just going to add in our olive oil. So after we have our olive oil, we have our onion, our bell pepper, our spring onion, our garlic. This is a very easy, delicious recipe for you guys. You guys can check out this recipe and let me know. There's nothing too difficult in this recipe. After having the, going to add in the, the pap chow, but we call it pap chai. In Jamaica, we call it pap chow. They already washed already. I already cut them up and I froze them. If you guys have it, you can you guys can wash it up and then wash it and put it in the freezer. You can keep it in the fridge and you don't cook it. Maybe it's gonna go off in the fridge. So I ain't gonna add no water to this. Give that a nice stir. I ain't gonna add in the powder season as yet. Gonna put the lid on that. Give that two minutes before I add in the onion powder, and the garlic powder, and the salt. Yes, my beautiful people. So now I'm just gonna add in the onion powder. You see, I don't add any water to it because pap chai was springing home water. Otherwise, that's pap chow. So now we're just going to add in the garlic powder. Pinch of salt. Onion powder. That's all we're going to add in it. We're going to add in no all-purpose season and nothing like that. I'll give this another two minutes and that's ready to go. Because this is very easy to cook, guys. Yes, my beautiful people. So this is all finished, guys. Give this at least eight minutes on the fire. Take off the lid off of it because if you put the lid on it, you're gonna sweat a lot of water because we're cooking pap chow or pap chai. So we don't want a lot of water in it. If you look at the pop bottom here, we have limited water in it. We don't want want that water in it. So this is all finished, my beautiful people. You don't want to overcook your your pap chow. So please give me a thumbs up for the video and please share and like the video with your friends and family. And please check out the channel for the rest of the awesome delicious recipe I have on my channel. I have nearly 200 videos there guys. You guys can check out all of my delicious recipe and please send me a comment. Don't scare to send me one and two comments. Anybody want to be a patron? The link is there. You guys can sign up to be a patron. You guys want to support self and YouTube page. Because we have a lot more recipe coming out, my beautiful people. If you guys want to support Selvin Kitchen YouTube page, guys, you can drop me a donation. Feel free. So this is all finished, guys. This is a beautiful recipe. So I will see you guys in the next video. Stay safe. Selvin Kitchen. What would my beautiful people?